Meet Jane. She's the proud parent of Annie. Meet Annie. She's Jane's daughter and a Kevin Hines Grow participant. Meet Elle. She's an OT who loves to help young adults with different abilities like Annie. Annie explained that she wants to be more independent now that she's a young adult. But Jane worries because she thinks Annie may never be able to achieve this. Elle comforts Jane and reassures her that this can be achieved when everyone works together. But Jane gets frustrated because she doesn't know where to start. Elle explains there's a new manual on its way to help guide facilitators, carers and parents. And it looks like this. Jane and Elle look through the manual together and like what they see. It sets out important independent living skills and explains three streams based on Maslow's hierarchy of needs. Each stream is six months long, addressing one living skill per month. Smaller weekly focuses are presented each week and a showcase to share their new skills is suggested at the end of the module. The manual explains the goal, plan, do, check, problem solving method and blank template lessons guide facilitators through the process. There are sample lessons and checklists before and after each focus. And evaluation forms based on the copy for baseline, mid and end of program assessment. Funding information and useful resources are a nice addition. When Annie finishes a module, she'll receive a certificate. The manual also has ideas for home activities to help Annie with problem solving and templates for her support team to share their positive comments. It won't be long before the companion portfolio arrives. It's a guide for self-modelling and a place to keep track of process. Tying the whole integrated process together under one global problem solving umbrella. And now, Jane is smiling again. And everyone is jumping for joy. But not quite as much as Annie and her Kevin Hines friends who are on their way to independence.